Hey everybody, how y'all doing? I know it's been a bit, been busy making a living, but got out here tonight, a little chilly out, but I got out here and tried to catch this uh, Jupiter and Saturn in conjunction. I missed it last night, but I did get out there and try to get a little footage tonight. Now I didn't, you know, change the aperture to try to get the rings to come in real good, but a general overview of what's going on, uh, the whole thing, you know, it only happens every 800 years, I understand. Right, right there. What, that's Saturn. It's that conjunction I've been hearing about. So you got Jupiter and the moons right here. Get it focused in there. Wow. Look how close Saturn is. Wow. If I can get the camera to be still. There we go. Yeah, see Saturn up there to the right. You can see the rings. Let me see if I can go in on it. Focus a little bit. Sorry about the shaking. Hard to get it in focus. Right about there. Anyway, back out a little bit. There we go. So there's Saturn and Jupiter and its moons. How cool is that? Back it up a little bit. So I understand this doesn't happen, but like, you know, eons apart. I can't remember what they said the last time we had this type of conjunction. Of course, it was last night when they were all lined up. I missed it. It was cloudy. But yeah, that's it from a distance. So there's Jupiter and Saturn. Let's see if we can focus it a little better. All right, let's let that set. Yeah, you can see the rings around Saturn. And Jupiter should be coming into the picture. <clears throat> camera just doesn't want to cooperate. See, when I try to hold it, it makes it shake. Anyhow, let's just zoom in. Okay, Jupiter. Saturn. Sorry about the shaking, y'all. That's what happens. But look how close they are. Alright. That's a first for me. Right there beside each other. I thought it was the moons at first. Jupiter and its moons. And I remembered, oh yeah, Saturn is up there doing something. So, there you go. Come around here and take a quick look at the moon. If I can find it here, yeah, right there it is. I do believe we have about a half moon. I always love that Terminator line. If I can let go of the camera now. Let me see if I can, uh, same issue. All right. Pretty wacky. Look at the top up there. It's got a face sticking out. Wacky stuff, that Terminator line. All right, let's see if I can find the tripod handle. Where are you at? Oh, way down here. No wonder. All right, let's let that roll.
That's the bottom part there, of course. Not quite as wacky as the top, but they've got some stuff. Look at the wishbone down at the bottom left there, sort of like. That's kind of neat looking. Yeah, the top up there is kind of weird too. We'll let it finish passing here. Get a close look at that. Wow. <laughs> All right. I believe that's about it. Let's ease back on it. And one more close, close look up here. That's weird right there. Isn't that weird? I wish I could steady it. Crazy. Bottom looks weird, don't it? Yep. All right, now. Really weird. All right. Notice how I didn't change the focus from the moon to Jupiter. Watch, I'll pull Jupiter again in. And you'll see I ain't going to touch the focus and watch. Jupiter will be right in focus. Where's that? Right there. Yeah. Watch this to be in focus, which suggests that they're about the same distance. See there? Still in focus. Well, maybe just a little off. Let me see. No, that's about right. Right. Yeah, it was in focus. There it is. And to further prove my case, I'll zoom out and go back up to the moon. And if I can find it, there it is. We'll go back in, and you'll see that it is perfectly in focus. See there? So, that kind of suggests that they're the same distance apart. Technically, I, you know, I've heard this um, from a couple of different people talking about how that suggests that they're the same distance, likely course you know I don't have a measure and tape to go measure it but still in focus I could get the uh, if I change the uh, aperture I could get the uh, Saturn um, rings around it but anyhow I'm not gonna mess with that tonight it's cold out here and what do we got up here? Looks like a plane. I wonder if we can take a closer look at it. Is that it? Yeah. It's a plane. At least I think it is. It looks... Huh. Whoops. Where'd you go? Yeah, it's got to be a plane. Come on now. There you are. Shepherds. It's moving quite fast. Wish I could stay up with it and get right in on it. Man, it is moving. Keep having to find it. See there? Almost look like a V. Huh. It's got to be a plane. Yeah, it's hard to stay up with it. It's moving so fast. Dang it. Try one more time. Catch it, and I've got a mosquito biting my leg. Alright, I'm about to give up on you. One last time here. If you'd slow down a little bit, I might could catch it. 
Ah, it's just too fast. All right, that's it, y'all. I'm gonna call it night. There goes Jupiter. Wait, one more time. Just to show you guys how close Jupiter and Saturn are tonight. Look at there. Whoops. All right. That's it. I'm out of here. Uh, and zoom out. Okay, that's it. I'll talk to you guys later. Y'all take care. God bless.